Welcome once more to Football for Beginners. Today, we will explain and demonstrate the crowd-pleasing touchdown dance. Now, touchdown celebrations are unusual and often humorous displays performed by professional football players after scoring touchdowns. We asked some folks on the streets of Toronto to show us their very own touchdown dances. Wee! Terrible. <laughs> Pathetic. It's a touchdown. <laughs> Two thumbs down, way down. <laughs> Redful. The touchdown dance, also known as the sack dance, <laughs> takes many forms, only some of which involve acting like a chicken. New York Giants wide receiver Homer Jones is credited with performing the first touchdown celebration in 1965 when he threw the ball into the field at his feet and the spike was born. Since that time, we've had the famous icky shuffle, the bob and weave, even a river dance or two. The contemporary popularity of anthropomorphism means that many a sack dance has been inspired by the animal kingdom. For example, there's the squirrel, the worm, and the peacock. A surprising number of touchdown celebrations invoke the behavior of poultry, specifically the chicken. Who could forget the chicken dance, the funky chicken, and my own particular favorite, the dirty bird. Take it away, Daryl. I need music. You don't need music. You don't need. Just... <sighs> Steve Smith of the Carolina Panthers was known for treating the football like a baby, changing the football's diaper, wiping it down, then rocking it to sleep. Chad Johnson of the Cincinnati Bengals used to perform CPR on the football. And Terrell Owens of the 49ers once celebrated with a pair of pom-poms borrowed from a cheerleader. In 2006, the NFL amended its rules to include an automatic 15-yard penalty against any player who, quote, leaves his feet or uses a prop people. The lesson here is simple. Everybody hates a prop comic. <laughs> The Super Sports Pack, exclusively from Rogers, is your ticket to the most sports and the most games in HD from every team in the NFL, the NHL, MLB, and more.